that, I decided, you know, I had um, the sprayer in here that I had put in here with water and bleach. I think I'm gonna add some more bleach and take it out there to spray down everything that's covered with mold to see if we can't get rid of the mold. We'll try it and see what happens. I am uh, currently spraying down everything with uh, water and bleach spray to try to get rid of all this mold and mildew. You can see that it's pretty bad. It's all over everything. I can't believe how fast this stuff grew. So we'll see if um, this treatment works. Actually, I think it's working. Yeah, spray all this. Oh man, I'm getting bleach all over myself too. Not good. I think we can see the um, mildew disappearing. So this bleach is working really well. And we gotta do all this. My hands are burning. This is a strong mixture. I think it's got like um, one to ten? I don't know. I took the water and I added like this, there was this much water and I added this much bleach and then I added more water. So, but there might have been bleach in it already. Although I think bleach after a while goes away. I don't know. But we can see it's actually working. The, um, the mildew or the mold is disappearing from that. So that might need a second treatment at the spots that still have them. But most of it is starting to disappear. I'm just going to try to treat the bedding area here now. Before I do that, I'm going to sweep it a little bit with this little sweeper. It's breaking all these tiles. Because this is from me climbing on here. So we're just going to um, sweep everything and then um, start spraying. Hopefully... See, it just broke all these tiles here. I may end up removing all these tiles. I don't know. What do you guys think I should do? So we're gonna we're gonna spray all that. See if it works. If it does, we're back in business. I think maybe I should work from the back up front. So we're gonna spray back there. Spray that area especially. Hopefully this stuff will work as well as, um, as quickly as the, uh, mildew formed. I'm gonna go ahead and turn off the camera because it's hard for me to spray and, um, film. Just thought I'd show you what's going on with the, um, stuff I sprayed. You can see all the mildew or mold is, like, actually gone. Although the thing's getting discolored, it's becoming light because of the bleach. But I'd rather have that than the mold and mildew, right? Surprised at how fast and how well it worked. Look at that. Mildew's all gone. The uh, wood got rid of most of the mildew. There's some spots that I may need to go over. But it's still kind of soaked. I'm out of um, the bleach mix. So I'll need to get more. But... Remember how covered this one was? It still has some. I'm going to spray some again some more. Or it, still, it still soaks, so I'm just going to let it sit. And I'll come back and check on it another day, maybe tomorrow or another day, if I can get back out here and see what it looks like. 
but for now um, the roof is somewhat stabilized I think the whole year to stabilize now it's um, not as strong as I want it to be yet but it is more stable than it was before and I don't think the roof will collapse again unless the storm's like extremely bad because this is stronger than how it was when I left it with Nick um, you know that was just a temporary fix and I kind of knew it would fall down with the storm that we had there's only one pole got two here they're not super big or strong but um, I think they're a lot more stable than the original two were and um, with the roof covered now I think um, and no no fronds on the the roofing I think we're good I think it's gonna um, let the rain run off I hope the rain doesn't collect I need to be out here when it's actually rain rain like really pouring rain and that way I can see where the water's collecting and um, fix those areas where the water's collecting because that's where the weight starts to form and then next thing you know the roof is collapsed well I thank you all for joining me until next time everybody have a great day